All right, Cass. Hey, right, look. So, let me give y'all a little background regarding my health. You feel me? I know a couple of niggas was wondering, right? Look, you know, I'll get more in detail on my fitness page, my nigga. It's called Fit Crip, nigga, capital F I T. Uh, space, nigga, <laughs> capital C R I P, right? Uh, nigga, um, you know what I'm saying? Hey, y'all niggas can follow me on the motherfucking gram too, cuz that was my YouTube. Y'all niggas can follow me on the gram at C U N Y underscore fitness, right? Cuz, you know what I'm saying? I want to help y'all niggas, cuz I really do, my nigga. I want to, you know what I'm saying? Like, I want to, nigga, cuz manhood, cuz to me, I don't know for y'all, but manhood, not only is it up here and spiritual, cuz it's on the physical too, you feel me? And I want to help y'all niggas achieve both. My nigga be strong at both, cuz, like, on some real shit. <clears throat> but look, to give y'all a background on myself, though, my nigga. So, I used to be 300 and, like, 20 pounds, cuz. I wasn't always that way. I used to be hub as fuck, too, you feel me? But, you know, I was always off and on with my workout, so I never got big. You know what I'm saying? But I got big because I had, I was playing football. I used to play semi-pro cuz, and I had a high ankle sprain. So, nigga, it was bad, though. So, I couldn't, uh, I was on my ass, man. It, it took me a long time, cuz, to really, really recover from that, my nigga. But, you know what I'm saying? I was, nigga, pretty much, cuz, nigga, I was pretty much eating the way I was eating, not being active, my nigga, right? I was eating like shit, nigga. Like, let's, let's keep it cripping, my nigga. I was eating like shit and being on my ass, right? So... I got to 320 pounds, nigga. Cheeks all fat. Titties. Come on, my nigga. Uh, and I'm not a I'm not a very tall man, cuz I'm 5'11, my nigga. So, nigga, so you know 320 nigga really look a little certain type of way on a crib, right? So, nigga, I woke up, I'm I'm listening to some content on YouTube. You know how a motherfucker just talk to you, cuz? He ain't talking to you, nigga, but he talking to you. Cuz it's like from here on now, cuz I got my ass up, nigga. I went to the gym that next morning, cuz, and I never stopped. I never stopped. It's like this, cuz it won't take you long. For instance, for all my niggas who may be big or may want to get strong, to lose weight, it won't take you long. So it won't take you as long. All right, look. So the way I am now it took me two years to get this way. Uh, I don't take no protein shakes, no nothing. It's just straight food, and I don't even eat the way that you niggas may think I probably eat. I eat two big ass meals a day, a little small meal. You know what I mean? I'm like some some nuts, no homo, nigga. Maybe like some fruit. You feel me? Just to keep the fiber going. You feel me? But you know, my breakfast is where I get the majority of my fiber from. You know what I'm saying? And then the dinner too. But I eat nothing but pure ingredients. I don't drink no juice, no soda. If you ever come over to my house to see some motherfucking juice, nigga, just trust me, nigga. I didn't drink that shit. Probably for a bitch. You see some alcohol. Probably for a bitch, because you know, like, nigga, when you come over, my name, sit over there, make sure you got a good ass tie, you feel me, right? But, uh, yeah, nigga, um, I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna tell you some ways, my nigga. Let me get you, let me finish my background, though. I went from 320 to under 200 pounds. Didn't like that. Didn't like, I look good. I look lean, nice and lean, but I didn't. I like to I like to look and feel big and feel strong, nigga. So I was like, fuck that. Eight more, you feel me? And nigga, now I'm about uh when I last weighed myself, I was 230. Um 230, my nigga. Um, you know what I'm saying? It just it just took work, my nigga. I got a I got a slim waist, cuz. Strong, my nigga. I, I look good, my nigga, you know what I'm saying? You know, I still got work to do, my nigga. I still want a certain type of body. I still want to harden everything up even even more. Because, like, when you bodybuilding, because it takes time. 
But to lose weight, you can lose, you can really lose it as fast as you want to. You know what I'm saying? But to do it in a healthy way, just clean up your diet. Everything gonna fall off. See, motherfuckers, look at it like this. Did it take you overnight to get as big as the fuck you got? Did it take you that long? Did it take you overnight to get them titties that you got, nigga? No, nigga, it was a process, nigga. Just like it's gonna be a process to lose the weight. But trust me, my nigga, you can do it, my nigga, with the dedication. My nigga, we are men. So, nigga, you know what I'm saying? Our mental game is stronger than anybody else, my nigga. It's stronger than a woman's, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like, nigga, like, our discipline, nigga, our, our thinking is just on another level. You feel me? So, my nigga, it's an expectation that whatever you want to do, nigga, you got to put your mind to it. When you tell your mind, like, I'm going to do it, you're going to do it. Uh, you just got to sit over there, my nigga, and get out your own way. But yeah, my nigga, I went under 200. I'm 230 now. Probably maybe about maybe two mid 230s now, you feel me? Uh, cause when I was real swole and had a slim waist, you feel me? And really was just real, I was about 260, my nigga. Cause I got the frame. I, I got the math for that. I don't, I don't, I don't think I want to get to 260. I think the most that I'd ever, that I'll get is somewhere in the 240s. You know what I'm saying? I, cause if anything, I'm cutting back, you feel me? If I'm getting bigger than that, you feel me? But you know what I'm saying? I'm enjoying my look though. 230 in the 230s. That fits me. That really fits me. Uh, so I'm keeping, I, I, I say 230s. And don't worry about weight, right? Worry about the look. Worry about how you look in the mirror, how you feel. You know what I'm saying? This is the best shape that I've ever been in my whole entire fucking life, my nigga. I'm 29 years old going on 30 this year, nigga. This is the best shape that I've ever fucking been in, my nigga. And, I, and, and this is when I was playing sports and all that shit. Because I sit over there, you understand me? I looked at myself, corrected my diet. I don't eat certain shit. I don't eat pork. I don't eat beef. I don't eat dairy. I don't eat processed foods. I cook everything, you feel me? I don't be yamming my shit with hella seasonings, nigga. I just eat pure ingredients. I, yeah, I damn near eat the same shit every fucking day, my nigga. Like, the only time you probably ever see me eat a little something just a little bit off, my nigga, uh, but still in the realms of what I eat is when, if a bitch cooking. That's it. I cook my meals, though. A crit learned how to cook like a year ago, nigga. I'm going to keep it cripping. My nigga, I used to always have a bitch cook for me, nigga. Or I used to always have my mama cook for me on Crip Gay. Nigga, I used to call my mother. Hey, Bob. Hey, what you cooking, though? You feel me? Or I used to sit over there and go knock me a bitch. Hey, bitch, I'm hungry, though. You feel me? What's happening, though? You understand me, nigga? Like, but you know what I mean? I'm like, fuck that. You know what I mean? I need to sit over there and be able to. Because, you know, sometimes a bitch will try to use that against me. You know, the bitch knew I couldn't cook. So she'll try to hold that shit. All right, you got me fucked up. I ain't trying to have no bitch hold nothing against me, nigga. So when I sit over there and learn how to cook, cuz, that was the last thing a bitch could ever try to hold against me, my nigga. Because, nigga, she can't do Because, nigga, I, I, I get my own cheddar. You understand me? I, I, I do my own thing. I'm still sufficient. I can figure everything else out. Nigga, I get it done. Nigga, I just wasn't cooking. So when I sit over there and learn how to cook, the bitch got the bitch actually got bad at me that I learned how to cook and she couldn't keep it over me though, Ken. But let's get back to this shit though. Uh nigga, stay true. Stay true, nigga. Stay true. Nigga, stay consistent. There's gonna be times where you're like, damn, it's not coming fast enough. Stay consistent. Consistency and discipline got me to where I'm at, my nigga. And that's where we get you anywhere that you want in life, my nigga. Consistency and discipline, my nigga. You have them, you have them things, my nigga. Man, you're gonna be on point. Man, you're gonna be cold. I, I, I swear, my nigga, you're gonna be cold as fuck, my nigga. And everything you do, my nigga, be obsessed with this shit. I'm obsessed with this shit, my nigga. I'm sitting over here, you understand me? I woke up this morning, I'm feeling, nigga, nigga, I was feeling real good. I'm like, yeah, nigga, let me sit over there, nigga. I sit over there and wash the motherfucking dishes, cuz, nigga, I'm out there, nigga, just, nigga, I did a, nigga, my program, cuz, today, nigga, I did a hundred, hundred burpees, nigga, uh, 30 down push-ups, nigga, and 40 jumping jacks and inch to inch worms, nigga, because I was on one today, nigga. But you know what I'm saying? I'm just, I just wanted that bad, nigga. You know what I'm saying? I just want to be cold that fucking bad. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? And I ain't gonna lie, it started to get to my head that a motherfucker coming to me looking at me talking about, God damn, nigga, like how you get that way? And a bitch sit over there, you understand know me, nigga? When I sit over there, take off my shirt, a bitch like, mm. you feel me, nigga? You just hear that bitch, like, oh, 
God damn, you feel me? Bitches all above me, shit like, yeah, bitch. <laughs> Come on, Kev. I want y'all niggas to experience that shit with me too, though, Kev. I'm going to need y'all sit over there, my nigga. If you niggas ain't got no chest, if you niggas built like Snoop Dogg, cuz, I'm going to need y'all niggas to go sit over there, you understand me, and put some more calories in you, cuz, and hit these weights, huh? If you got some titties, my nigga, bigger than a bitch, I'm going to need you to sit over there, my nigga, turn them tits into pecs, my nigga. I'm going to need y'all to get right, cuz. I'm going to need y'all to get right. Follow my shit, cuz. I'm going to sit over there and be, be giving this motherfucking game out, though, for you niggas, though. Follow my shit, my nigga. I got you niggas, cuz. I got you niggas. My nigga, I know you I know you little lame-ass niggas, my nigga, be sitting over there, cuz, my nigga. I know y'all lost. I know the lame niggas is lost, and I know the niggas who want direction. I know they lost, my nigga. I used to be lost. But now I'm found like amazing grace, nigga. And I want to help y'all niggas be, nigga, be found, my nigga. My nigga... When there's a multitude of counsel, cuz, my nigga, there's no way to fail. When there's a multitude of counsel, there's no way to fail. You know what I'm saying? So, my nigga, just, just look at me as my nigga, part of your part of your counsel, my nigga, to help you niggas, you feel me? And if you niggas want to sit over there, my nigga, want some gang, cuz, like, or crush some gang, like, hey, my nigga, how the fuck should I approach a bitch? On this level, how should I sit over there, you feel me, and approach my health and fitness on this level? Either I'm going to sit over there to take you to my fitness page, my nigga, or I'll address it on this page because I got you, niggas, because, my nigga, whether you white, black, orange, red, I got you, motherfucker, you feel me? Because it's crit, nigga. You know what I'm saying, nigga? Uh, you know what I'm saying? Like, come on, my nigga. I just want all y'all niggas to be cold, my nigga. I want y'all niggas to restore manhood, nigga. Whether you from the set or you not from the set, nigga, I want you niggas to restore manhood, nigga. We got to sit over there and set an example for these bitches, nigga, to follow, cuz. It's like, you know what I'm saying? When you sit over there and hold yourself accountable, nigga, and help these bitches to a high standard like yourself, my nigga, they have no choice but to fall in line. But you got to get yourself in line first, though, family. You know what I'm saying? You got to get yourself. You got to get yourself in line first, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like... It took a, it should take time though. You don't just grow overnight. You go through, nigga, I go through my bumps and bruises, my nigga. I sit over there sometimes, nigga, you know what I mean? Feel like, you know what I'm saying? I might be regressing. It, but I had to sit over there, nigga, and check myself. Cause really, my nigga, really, my nigga, you know what I'm saying? I pretty much, nigga, be thugging it on alone, my nigga. So, uh, my best, my best motivator. Uh, my motherfucking nigga that's gonna hold me accountable is my shelf, my nigga. But I'm cool with that, you feel me? I done come this far, my nigga, so, you know what I mean? Nigga, I can get farther, though, you feel me? But it's good that, nigga, if we could all come together, you feel me? And really just, nigga, uplift each other, my nigga, to keep motivation, my nigga. Because there might be a nigga right now that may need some some motherfucking inspiration and some uplifting, my nigga. And if I could sit over there and, and see that for you, cuz, my nigga, I'd be more than happy to, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Uh, nigga, when shit start getting when shit start getting real smoky, cuz, and nigga, I'm able to go live, cuz, my nigga, you know, I'm going to have them phone calls, my nigga, and where I can sit over there, my nigga, and, and have them phone calls and call in on the crib, my nigga, so I can get y'all down. I know a lot of y'all niggas going to be talking that shit, cuz, and just, hey, make sure y'all stay on the phone line when I start shooting them back, though, but, uh, yeah, nigga, uh, <laughs> you feel me, nigga, uh, yeah, nigga, come on, cuz, let's just shine, nigga, let's just shine together, cuz, my nigga, let's, my nigga, there's enough, there's enough money out there for all of us to get. The bank out there creating money right now as you speak, nigga, in the motherfucking money machine, nigga. Nigga, there's, a, nigga, there's enough bitches, nigga, for us all to sit over there, my nigga, and have a multitude if that's what we want, my nigga. Nigga, let's shine. Nigga, let's just come together and shine, my nigga. Even if you don't want to come together and shine, nigga, if you want to just shine on your own, do that, nigga. But just make sure you shine. But all right, nigga. Hey, I like coming and fucking subscribe, nigga. We out though, low.